joined us. We are marching. Uh, we are in Cunia. I think I think the city stole mine this morning. I'm going to get a little bit ahead so that we can uh, hey, no. see. Uh, I'm going to get over on this side. This side? This way. We're going to go out to the stop point and we're going to take a right. Okay. So what can you end? That way and then That's way for everybody to catch up here. Yeah, we don't have to run. Huh? We can like show these people what's up. Yeah. Definitely oh. show people. Hi, Nomi. I didn't even say hello. Sorry. Aloha. <laughs> <laughs> Give a hug. <laughs> you don't have the backpack sign. I think I caught for the first time at the ledge when you were running around. <laughs> Our bearings here. We've got a bunch of people here. Just I don't know. Yeah. Get in front of the crowd here so we can catch. Yeah. That's a decent bunch of guys. Tell them they can slow down. They don't have to run up the street. God's sake, this is a demo. <laughs> We're approaching uh, Kunia Road. Our destination is about half a mile up the uh, road and a lot of traffic here. In front of the uh, Monsanto uh, headquarters or fields, of course, they own or lease a tremendous amount of uh, farmland on this island, on Molokai, on the other islands. Uh, and we'll get some uh, interviews with people later on. Really should run across the street to get a good idea here. Not too uh, happy with some of the official crowd control. Moving a little slower here so that they can stretch out along the sidewalk. A lot of signs. You can see a lot of traffic here. People already showing some support. We've got a lot of different groups. These people in green from uh, Makavalu, activist group, an Akamaoli group, native Hawaiian group. Uh, maybe I'll... Uh, I'm going to stand. Thank you. There are a lot of police here. I'm going to stand here so we can get an idea of the people involved and the signs streaming live nationwide, worldwide. Got all kinds of people here. Good demographic, age, neighborhood, label GMO, a big issue here.
people from uh, the Occupy Honolulu. Monsanto big uh, GMO product is uh, corn and seed corn. That was uh, Pono Ke Aloha. Covers everything, and I never get my own photo taken with these things. So thank you very much. a big group. Here's Walter Ritty. Hey. <laughs> get him off Hawaii. Get him off Hawaii. Okay. That's Walter Ritty. We'll go follow uh, Walter up the street. And then we'll get, get a few words with him once we uh, get up there. from passing by. <laughs> you, uh, you got you do good sign, bro. I did? Yeah. <laughs> let me let me just show what sign I'm looking at. Stop straight shit. <laughs> Absolutely. Straight up. Straight up. GMO is Soylent Green, that's what Walter Reed is carrying on the reverse of his side. This uh, March uh, co-organized, or I guess mostly organized by the new group, Babes Against Biotech. Broad uh, antipathy for GMO, broad support for anti-GMO or GMO labeling. Um, yet uh, legislation is hard now. Why is that? GMO industries represent uh, some of the biggest uh, contributors in terms of uh, financial contributors to politicians campaigns we would call that lobbying groups <laughs> we just passed uh, Walter Ritty I'm gonna make my way upstream here so we can get more of the signs We're walking uh, uphill Punia, the area from here, uh, from the uh, southern part of the island up the central uh, agricultural part of the island to the north shore. So we're heading uh, generally north or toward the uh, fields. Getting a lot of support from people passing by. Honks mean support, definitely. <laughs> yep. This is her first trip. Yeah, see, that's, <laughs> right. that's right. <laughs> One time honking is a good thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just join us, we're marching up uh, Punia Road to the Monsanto headquarters. I'm stuck here in the middle of a fairly narrow sidewalk, so you can't really get the magnitude of the uh, march, but that'll be uh, changed once we get there and I get to walk around a bit, maybe talk to people. Now, on uh, 
This is kind of the area that used to have a lot of fields, and I think there's still fields around here, but also fields that are of the kind that generally get turned into a housing subdivisions. So we were in a shopping complex, and we see a neighborhood right on the other side of the road. We'd like those people to know that one of their neighbors is Monsanto uses uh, very high doses of herbicide to sterilize their fields since the product that they produce here in uh, Hawaii is uh, generally seed, seed product, which require totally sterilized soil, soil that ha has nothing alive in it. And of course that herbicide ends up in the the ground, in the water supply, in the food chain. Uh, when Captain Cook arrived, 1778 and 79, third journey ended in 1779, the population of Hawaii, the islands, were probably near one million people. That's without uh, you know, what we call modern infrastructure and that sort of thing. It was very agriculture intensive. They used uh, what would now be called uh, permaculture. In fact, the permaculture movement studied uh, ancient uh, Hawaiian agricultural techniques in order to formulate their system. But the West brought in the West America brought in, the United States brought in a industrial uh, food, uh, industrial agricultural production. Oops. I'm going to try and get around you here. Thank you. So that all with even with all the uh, ag land that we have, Hawaii uh, imports 90 percent. Over 90% of its uh, food. A lot of people want to change that. Well, that's the sense of that sign. Poison ground, poison food. The poison goes into the ground. Poison goes into the food. of the, uh, I think you can see the beautiful uh, mountains, the uh, Waianae Range. I'm going to spin around a little bit to see that we got a bunch of people in the back too. Good demographic. Kids. It's their uh, first demonstration. You have to learn, and uh, this is a good this is a good one to learn. At. <laughs> it it's a textbook demonstration in a lot of ways because it brings together a lot of different groups. There are. Uh, um, Hawaiian groups, uh, Kanaka Maui groups that are concerned with uh, restoration of uh, of uh, self-government, you know, sovereignty, control of land and society. Um, the Occupy Honolulu has a contingency here. This is we're passing a neighborhood now. I don't know when they. If when they bought their houses, they knew that uh, Monsanto would be their neighbor and what Monsanto is doing, the application of the uh, herbicides, of course, um, is not only in the food, in the ground, in the water, but it's also in the air. Getting 
some support from uh, Directly in front of me is a uh, public affairs officer, police department, dressed in a uh, aloha shirt and a uh, straw looking hat, but really kind of a crowd control uh, function. Uh, first uh, used during the Asian Development Bank. Waving at the uh, people that honk for support. You can see a well traveled road. It is uh, quarter to four, 345 our time here. And a lot of, lot of support. A lot of support from, from people. One of the recent controversies is uh, Bishop Estate Kamehameha Schools leasing of their land to uh, biotech GMO companies, including Monsanto. Now, uh, Bishop Estate Kamehameha School is uh, up, um, mission is to educate uh, native Hawaiian students and they have large land holdings and business portfolios in order to help do that and uh, some people have pointed out something of a disconnect between the mission of the school and the means uh, to actually uh, fund that mission you just joined us, we're walking up Punia Road toward Monsanto headquarters. Sorry for kind of the static point of view, but I'm on a relatively uh, narrow sidewalk. Once we get there, I'll be able to walk around, talk to people. Hope to interview. Uh, Walter Reedy is here, along with uh, some of the Babes Against Biotech, Nomi uh, Kaheo and Alani Carmona. One of the uh, organizers, along with James Macy. I'd like to interview actually uh, one of the Aloha cops to <laughs> see what they have to say. Uh, the organization for this uh, demonstration was so successful it attracted the attention of the Honolulu Police Department who are out in force. There are probably half a dozen or more uh, Aloha cops and a number of other I think this is the corner. Is this the corner? Uh, oh, I'm well, going across. across the street, and some of you guys are allowed to go across the other way. The poles are actually there for your safety, just to keep you guys away from. Oh, those cones traffic. up there? Yeah, so the poles are laid out on both sides just to keep um, the vehicle I traffic see. to oh, slow so down. So we can get on yeah. either side. Uh, yeah. One contingent on the other side of the street. And uh, I'll be moving up. Kind of now in group. We got one uh, chanting group on the uh, 
other side, we got one group uh, on that corner. You can see subdivision Royal Korea. I don't know if they know their neighbors are Monsanto, and then we've got a bunch of people over here on this side. Take a sizable group here. So far a lot of public support. Let's see if I can get this picture. I'm holding it up. I'm crossing over. I don't know if some of us are going over to the honed area. This side. Get ahead here. Maybe some people should get on this side. We should keep some maybe on this side. Behind the we can get behind those cones. They set those cones up, we might as well use them, I think. Cold area. Oh, only on the sidewalk. I see. Okay, we'll get on both sides. So we're gonna. We got enough people. We can take care of both sides of the, uh, the sidewalk here. So there are cones here to keep. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, keep cars from crashing into us or something, I don't know. And this right here is the actual gate. This is the Monsanto gate, right here, huh? We're right across the uh, Monsanto Gate. In fact, we can see some uh, I'm gonna try and get my other camera out here. Uh, sorry, while I kind of use my other hand, I'm gonna get some stills here. Now, I'm standing right in front of the actual Monsanto Gate. Where people are making their way. We can see some Monsanto personnel there. I'm getting my... This is what I'm doing. I'm getting my still camera out. Santa's been a big uh, supporter of our mayor, Mayor Carlisle, the same guy that ordered the raid on uh, the Occupy Hunan. Yeah, we're getting a lot of support from people. We got, we're on both sides of the street as you can see. sides here. We're right in uh, Kunia. A lot of uh, traffic. I didn't realize there's this much traffic during the day. All 
right. There's some like yelling going on. Over there. They're keeping the uh, protesters actually away from the actual front of the... Uh, we don't want your GMO! Not getting them, letting them get any closer than the actual front of the... Uh, we don't want your GMO! Of course, we have a big contingent here on this side, so what I'm going to do is get uh, over on the other side and get some uh, footage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 